Oh, hello? Are you feeling okay? You must be in agony because of the transformation. Oh, no, 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 it's okay. Don't worry, I'm not gonna hurt you. Just, just calm down. Look, my hands are empty, and I'm not even close enough to attack you. You can relax, I promise. My name? It's Dan. I live here, in the forest. You're actually in my cabin right now. Um, I kind of found you passed out on the ground and brought you back to my place. You know, to take care of you. You probably didn't realise it yet, but your body is full of scratches and bruises. Oh, uh, mm, yes, you are in the nude. I, I, I did try not to look as much as I could while I carrying you. After that, I laid you down on my couch and covered you with a blanket so I didn't really see anything, okay? I could have, you know, dressed you with something of mine, but... I would have had to touch you more, and I thought it would be better to not do that without your permission. W what? No, I I promise that I did not take your clothes off. When I found you, you were already naked. It's the truth, I swear. I did manage to find your clothes nearby, but they were torn to shreds. None of the pieces are wearable at all. Though, that is what happens when puppies like you transform for the first time. It's rough, believe me. What do I mean? Wait, you don't know? Oh, oh god, um, okay, listen. What I'm about to say is going to sound very weird, and you're definitely going to think I'm crazy, but you are a werewolf. And last night, there was a full moon, so you would have transformed. And seeing like you don't know what happened here, I guess it was your first time? <sighs> well, in fairness, I did tell you it was going to sound weird, but it is the truth. I'm not crazy, and I'm not lying. You are a newly turned werewolf, which is why I called you a puppy, because you kind of are one right now. All right, or all right, calm down, please. Panicking won't help you. Let me take care of you. Okay? Okay, I won't get any closer. No need to scream at me. I get it, you're confused and you're scared. I was just like you when it happened to me, so I understand. But I promise you, I am not a threat. I only want to help, and I definitely will, but you need to let me. Okay? Can you let me help you? Good. So, first of all, let's calm you down so we can talk properly. Take a deep breath in, and release it. Yes, that's it. Good job. Now, again, breathe in, and out. In, and out. That's right. Again, breathe in, and out. Yes. Good puppy. How are you feeling? Better? More relaxed? Great. I'm glad to hear it. Hmm. Do you want something to drink or eat at all? You must be hungry. Transforming takes a lot of energy out of us. No? Okay then. <laughs> Straight to business. So... What do you want to know first? Ask away. I'll tell you everything I know. The aching? Yeah. 
Now that all the adrenaline got out of your system, your whole body must be in agony. This is pretty normal, and unfortunately, you'll feel like this every time you turn. At least during the first few years. Well, your body is literally transforming. Your human form is being broken and put back together in a type of humanoid, wolfish form. It's obviously going to be painful. Why is this happening to you? That's a good question. I have no clue. All I can say is that you were bitten by a werewolf, survived, and now you're also a werewolf. But to the reason why? I don't know. I'm... I'm sorry. That's the only way regular humans can get turned into werewolves. By being bitten by one. That's why I know it happened to you. Ah, uh, yeah. Checks out. That wild animal that attacked you was probably a werewolf. Hey, 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 hey. Don't cry. You'll be fine. I know that things don't look good right now, but everything is going to be okay. I'm here, and I'm going to help you in any way that I can. Of course I'm serious. As someone who went through the exact same thing you're dealing with right now, I can just turn my back and leave you to fend for yourself. So, believe me when I say, you will be fine, and everything will get better. Because I'm here for you, puppy. So don't worry and just cry, if that's what you need to do. Yes, of course I can give you a hug. Come here. Shh, 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 shh. It's okay. It's going to be okay, my dear. Cry as much as you want. I understand. I know, puppy. I know. You're scared. But it's gonna be alright. I'm sure you're gonna push through this like a champion. I believe in you. <laughs> yes, I believe in you. I can sense you're a tough one. You may still be a puppy, but I sure wouldn't want to mess with you. <laughs> well, I'm glad that made you smile a little bit. You have a beautiful smile. And I'm going to do my very best to help you keep smiling like that. You're welcome, darling. Do you feel a little better now? Good. That's what I like to hear. I know it's hard to be positive right now, but it's good to have some hope, isn't it? See? You already took the first step to make everything better. Of course you can keep asking questions. I'll try and clear all your doubts. Well, I'll have to train you and help you prepare for future transformations. We're in a forest, so we don't need to worry about keeping you locked up during the full moon. After all, there are no other humans around here that could get hurt. We can just let you run around in the forest while you're turned. During transformations, I can keep an eye on you, you know, just to make sure you don't get hurt, or in case any unlucky humans stumble across your path. <sighs> the only way that I know of making transformations less painful and difficult is with plenty of rest, exercise, and time. In some years, after you turn a number of times, it won't hurt as much. And then, one day, you can even control the turning. Mm-hmm. It's completely possible. It's hard and demands a lot of concentration, don't get me wrong. But you can do it. It's been quite a while since I learned how, so I'm speaking from personal experience. As I said, it can take several years to control it, but it's better than you not being able to handle this curse at all. 
What? Why did the other werewolf bite you? Well, I have two theories, and I'm pretty sure you won't like the second one. The first theory is that it was a newly turned werewolf that bit you. As I explained, in the first few years, werewolves basically turn into completely savage beasts, and they're unable to control themselves. If they see something weaker than them, they'll consider it prey. And if it's prey, they hunt. But I think it's highly unlikely to have been from a new werewolf, because it's very rare to survive such attacks. It can happen, but it's very, very difficult. My second theory, on the other hand... <sighs> My second theory is that an older, experienced werewolf bit you on purpose, specifically to turn you. I think that because it's currently um, mating season for werewolves, and sometimes packs don't have enough partners for every member. So... Their werewolves that don't have a mate will go out looking for one. Either werewolves with no pack, or... humans. No, it's actually forbidden to mate with werewolves from other packs, so those are the only two choices. Find a werewolf without a pack, or... or find a human to turn. I'm the only werewolf without a group around here, so... The wolf that bit you probably thought you were a better pick for them than me. And if I'm correct about that theory, they are going to come after you to claim you as their mate. Hey, 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 don't worry. No one is going to take you away from here if you don't want them to. I'm not letting that happen. I'll protect you, I promise. Besides, we still have theory number one. It's not off the table. Maybe we're worrying without a reason. Do you remember when you were attacked? Five days ago? Oh, well... Um... New werewolves only turn on nights with a full moon. But... Older ones can control it. They can turn... Any day or time they want to. And this month's full moon was yesterday. So, the one that bit you had a transformation out of the correct schedule. Which means the second theory is nearly a hundred percent what happened. Shh, 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 calm down, okay? It's going to be okay. You really shouldn't be worrying about that right now. You have to drink some water, eat something, and go to sleep. Of course I'm serious. Thinking about what to do in case they come after you won't help you. You really should just rest as much as you can. And I'll stay with you while you sleep. I promise. No harm will come to you. You have my word. Yes, after you've rested, we can think about a plan. And believe me, we will find a solution. For now, I'll prepare you a warm bath and medicine for your bruises. After that, we eat breakfast. I'll also give you some of my clothes to wear. Is that okay? They're pretty big, but it's all I have to offer at the moment. Alright, good. I'll go prepare everything, so just sit tight and wait here, and I'll be right back. Hey, look at me. Please. I know you're really scared right now. Scared of what will happen to you if that werewolf comes here. But you're with me now, and whoever they are, they'll have to go through me. 
And if you can be sure of one thing about me, no one has ever been able to fight me and win. Never. And this time won't be different. Okay? Okay. Now, I'll be back in a bit. Take some more deep breaths if you need it, and just relax while I'm gone. It will seriously help you. <laughs> Good puppy.